Hello. You make meat recipes and you have been looking for ways to make your meat soft or tender and easy to chew. Okay, this recipe is for you. I'm going to show you one healthiest way to soften or tenderize your meat. So here I have about seven pieces of beef, okay, beef stick. So the first thing you need to do is to wash the meat, okay. Wash your meat thoroughly. After washing the meat, you transfer the meat into a clean plate. Then you add in your secret ingredient and that is my baking soda. <laughs> So I added just one tablespoon of the baking soda into this, then add half teaspoon of salt. Okay, so you go ahead and mix everything. Make sure that the salt and the baking soda coats every bit of this beef, okay? If you're making a larger batch, you can add or increase the quantity of baking soda a little, depending on the quantity you are making, okay? So after that, you cover this and keep this aside to rest for like four hours, five hours even, okay? This will help to soften this meat, guys, okay? Yeah. So you can make this maybe overnight, and keep it aside depending on when you want to use it now what this baking soda and the salt does is to draw out water from this meat as you can see there is there was no water in the plate before but now there is water and also it breaks down the protein in this meat so that the meat becomes softer okay so after <coughs> you must after the 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 four hours or thereabouts you have left the meat um you're going to wash you can see the meat is all uh, is almost just look at how soft it is it is now okay so you go ahead and wash the meat okay wash it thoroughly after washing the meat you dry the the meat okay you dry it with your um paper towel or a clean kitchen towel okay Make sure you wash it thoroughly like maybe two to three times this will help to remove excess baking soda uh, and salt from the meat okay make sure you wash it very well because if you don't wash it very well by the time you cook the meat you may get the taste of the baking soda somehow and you may not like it that much okay because what you want is for the meat to be soft and flavorful okay so i went ahead and made beef stir fry with this beef and believe me the softness <laughs> is everything the softness was everything there yeah. so you need to try this you need to just try this so when you are making your meat for your food and uh, for sale or for yourself just try this try this trick and believe me, you are going to love the outcome thank you for watching my videos please and don't forget to like subscribe and share